Yes! Finally nailed that. My guitar amp is dying, guys. I don't know what's going on. Something's probably wrong with the wiring. It's a really old amp. Like, I've had that thing since like 2000, maybe seven or eight. <laughs> it's been a long time. It's the, the test of time. It's a little Line 6, a Spider 2 or 3 or something like that. It's an old motherfucker, and I've had this guitar since like 2011 ish or so. It was an EC uh, 1000. And uh, yeah, this is my baby. I've had this thing for a while, played a few shows with it and everything. It's a, it's a pretty good guitar. Probably doesn't compare in quality to like the actual Japanese ESPs and shit. Because. I played one of those and those things are amazing compared to this. Like this thing is like cheap knockoff compared to those freaking insane, right? So, you know, you get what you pay for with that stuff. But uh yeah, it's a, today was a pretty good day. And uh it's a Saturday and I'm doing the same stuff as any other freaking day. But the difference between, or at least what I want to talk about is just the importance of having a routine down. Um, it's just, if we don't have a system or a routine, a discipline that we do on a daily basis, we tend to just fall into traps, fall into those fall back into those vices we fall back into just that depressed feeling because we don't have that set you know that grounded feeling that we accomplished exactly what we were meant to do if you don't have like the your routine or at least a scheduled task you know towards your goals like a lot of people just you know, basically cruise, they're on cruise control until the weekend. They just live for the weekend, basically, and that causes a lot of depression. I know it's happened to me. You know, being being stuck in a job that you end up hating, and you just build up all this resentment, but then you get over it because you have a weekend off, and you get to do whatever the fuck you want for those two two or three days, whatever, whatever you have, and you just end up getting complacent, and it's just not a good way to live, and so that, that's something that I've learned the hard way, it's just like, I've, I still have my nine-to-five job, but little by little, I'm becoming more useful to people, and be, um, learned a sort, sort of trade skill, I'm still basically, uh, trading my time for money but little by little watch like things are gonna happen I have this like uh this plan that I want to go through I'm probably gonna unveil it in the next few videos and it's gonna it's gonna be some a little project I'm working on that might be pretty fun because like I'm a big nerd I grew up playing a lot of RPG games like that that that's my shit like RPG games and uh, fighting games and stuff like that. That's my shit. RPGs the most, and I even enjoy like like I haven't played much, but like I even enjoy the concepts of like D and D games, and you know like some of my favorite games are the Souls games, and um, I just love the concept that I've heard from people of, of like basically looking at life as an RPG, you know, basically Skyrim your fucking life. And I'm like coming up with a way to do that, really like basically gaining life XP. And um, it's gonna be pretty fun, I think. And uh, I'm gonna try it out, I'm gonna post it out, see if people can catch on to it and 
maybe uh maybe it can become a, a cool little thing that that I can do with other people, you know? Gamify someone's life, you know. Sounds cool to me. So we'll see where that takes us. We'll see if uh if we can literally metaphorically and kind of literally in a game slay those dragons. You know, conquer see what we can conquer together, you know? See see uh I always see like you know a lot of games have these have this like system now like these seasons um because i was playing magic arena if you're familiar with that game or uh you know a lot of games have these now like like a lot of free to play games like fortnite um you know i don't play fortnite but i've seen it you know there's a lot of games that have like the season things and it's like oh you get a certain amount of xp or you get or you finish these certain tasks and every week and then you get a chance to to like keep going up in this you know on the seasons and, and unlock something cool at the end right you know i was wondering like what, what if you could do that in real life you know like like set up a little timeline where you could do every little task you you, you do in life get a little bit of xp and you get, get a little xp and you have like a little little avatar or something or like a cool freaking character and the more you do shit the more this guy get get strong as hell you know and it's like a, a little metaphor for for us you know so that, that's something i'm gonna be cooking up with cooking up uh, it's mostly just gonna be pen and paper kind of shit at first but you know who, who knows where it goes um Hopefully, I can get some support in this dream. But, uh, I'm gonna put some work into this. Mark my words. I'm gonna put some work into this. So, yeah, that, that's what I got for today. I believe it's day, day five or six. I've already lost track, but hey, what matters is that I'm showing up, right? All right, love you guys.